Shadow of the Hedgehog, go go, hit it. Nice to see you, Shadow Android, and you too, Omega. And even now, he continues to just screw with Shadow for no particular reason. Damage down there, but did you really think that you could challenge me, Doctor Eggman? I will destroy you and reign supreme. I thought that your whole idea was just to destroy him. I didn't. I don't really get where the whole Reign Supreme thing comes in. I thought you just had, like, sort of, you know, pissy vendetta against him. I wish to destroy Eggman. What then? I hadn't thought about it after that. Oh, great. This fucking boss. This is the most brilliant fucking boss in the history of anything that Eggman has ever created. If you disagree... You are dumb, as is Eggman. Seriously! You have fucking slot reels on the front of your fucking machine. And whatever they land on, and whoever presses the button when they land on all three, they attack whoever... Why did you design this, you numbskull? Why is it full of ri why is the arena, the center of the arena, why is it built to spew rings at all? Also, why did you design your machine to have a setting How does it to do this? How does it give Shadow superpowers? Not only does it give Shadow super abilities, but it just, how does it do it? I just want to know why. Why on earth would any ability... Why would you program in an ability in your mech to do that? One theory I've heard in that regard is that it's actually supposed to power up his androids. But I can't imagine it as androids being advanced enough to have that kind of power. They don't have enough polygons. If you can land the slot wheels on bomb or missile, you can attack Eggman. Now it also. <laughs> My beautiful rings! Why are you hoarding? Why are you hoarding rings? Why are you talking about why they're so beautiful? Uh, stupid boss is stupid. And what is with your gambling obsession? What is with everyone's gambling obsession in this universe? Well, I just killed myself. Moron. I just don't know what went wrong. Sorry, Doctor, but this is the end for you. Mission completed. I didn't really do anything. <laughs> Perfect. Except be there. Well, and what's more... Uh... Alright, here we are, the first fucking ending that we're getting to in this game. He doesn't even really want to take revenge on Eggman himself. He just sort of stands there and waits for Shadow to do something. I've got all the Chaos Emeralds. I made you, and this is how you repay me. Are you really insisting on this? <laughs> insisting on this joke even now? Created by Eggman. You may have created me, Doctor, but I will now lead this empire, and androids will rule. This is who I am. Androids rock. Eggman, target acquired. Locked and loaded. Oh. Fire. Oh, he does shoot. Goodbye, Doctor. No, no, he doesn't. <laughs> Karate chop. Alternatively, we could have done this. Like, at the last moment, despite hating Eggman so much, I decided, hey, why not? Let's, let's, let's try again. Let, let's, let's try and be friendly with the old, with the good old Doc. You know, do what he wants. The Chaos Emerald could wait. I, I, I like Eggman. But the Actually, 
well, we'll get into that as we get to the end of this, but, you know, among some of the things that you do in this fucking game with all the multiple pathways, all the things that you're capable of achieving, yes, you can finally decide to help Eggman and do his bidding to expand the Eggman Empire, but despite what you do to help certain people, oh boy, it's just like, you can't control why Shadow was making these decisions. Yes, he's decided to start to... You know what? Despite the fact that I'm an android and I, I want revenge against Eggman for being so stupid, uh, I'm gonna help him now. But why am I helping him? Damn, not here. <sighs> I failed at this part for some fucking reason. It's a very annoying platforming segment over fucking Lava Magma. Lava Magma. Yeah, it's... The Lava Magma is actually shallow in the place that I landed at right there. But just because I touched it, it's instant death. It lava might as well make magma. it... It shouldn't even be Lava Magma. Lava it be water. Magma! They should just call it Orange Kool-Aid. That's all it is. Please, God, not the lava magma. Orange Kool Aid. Because, you know. It's a flavor of Kool Aid. Okay. Well, in the case of orange, yes. Because orange is both a color and a flavor. Lava magma. Orange. It's not even red Kool-Aid, it's orange. But yeah, as we're going to see at the end of this pathway, despite the fact that, you know, we decided to help Eggman, uh, Shadow seems to think his reasons for doing so are something else from what I would like to do. I mean, what if I actually want to become one of Eggman's loyal Egg Pond servants instead of want to betray him and murder the ever-living fuck out of him just just because I'm an android dick. Well, Your that, missile wrists fail! Well, that would mean having choice. What, I made the choice of coming this far and taking up this mission? Why not? Alright, Shadow Laser. Hey man, this ain't Fallout. You can't join the Legion. Why would you join the Legion? Well, you can. Why would anyone join the Legion? Well, why would anyone join Eggman? Who truly one wants to join him? Anyone with any sanity would join either the NCR or what was the other choice? Anyone with a anyone with a brain would join Doctor House. Doctor Mister. We're not watching that show. If Dr. House were Mr. House, everyone would join it. Are you sure? Oh yay, platforming with these controls. Actually, I'm gonna say this right now. I think these controls are ever so slightly better than the shitty ass controls in Sonic Heroes. I think these are actually tolerable compared to Sonic Heroes. Oh yeah, I mean, I, I played I around with. Die here. You can't die here. Except I did. Thanks to Orange Kool Aid. Orange Kool Aid and rave lights. What was it? Ah! They can do the homing attack too. What the fuck? Dancing homing attack? Well, it looks like the robots are ninjas. Robot ninjas. You're doomed. Nah. If there's one thing that they can't deal with, it's blasters. They're too stupid to use guns! Because they have missile wrists. Why do they need guns when they have missile wrists? Do whatever you can to I remember now. 
Sonic X. The first fucking robot that he brought out when he came to Chris's world. Missile Wrist. Fantastic. That's what you remembering. Great. It was an East. It was just a standard East series robot in the Japanese version, if it's anything to go by. Because. Yeah. Everything is an E series robot when Eggman makes it. I mean. Oh, yeah. The uh, egg pawns are technically E 1001s. <laughs> yeah, that's right. another good thing. The light Why dash, the... the ring dash button is on another button. You don't have to worry about accidentally doing something stupid like falling to your the death after pressing the, the button. About my existence. Nobody lays a hand on him except me. I d okay. Wait, weren't you just helping me? I said no one lays a hand on you. You Except did very well, Shadow Android. You have surpassed expectations, equal to that of the real Shadow. <sighs> Excellent. Now give me those emeralds. Be honest, if Never. he had told, what? if he had told Shadow to that he was the he was the real Shadow, wouldn't that have actually you. been like you know good I news that would make Shadow happy? And may make it so that Shadow wouldn't try to kill him. For that matter, why did you bring out this fucking mech while assuming that Shadow was helping you? Yeah, we're not gonna watch that again. Yeah, no. Finally. I've got all the Chaos Emeralds. I made you, and this is how you repay me? I am Shadow Android, the ultimate life form. But if you're an android, you're not a hedgehog. Life form. With the power of these emeralds, Bio -android? I will be stronger than him. This Never is mean. who I it's am. It's not like they ever clarified what type what? of android he was supposed to be. Goodbye, Doctor. And granted that all the other androids are low-poly missile wrist firers. I don't know. Well, anyway, that's that for the, uh, both variations of the straight neutral pathway. Dad, and here we are please. with the end credits music to this pathway, Waking Up. Yes. Uh, not my favorite, but not my least favorite out of all the main themes of this game. The music, the only memorable music from this game. Bringing out. This, this is what it's like to be free. Keep it up, tear it down. This is what it means to be free. Yeah. But yeah, get used to this. We're gonna see this credits sequence. Actually, I don't know how many more times. Probably only gonna see it. Because I had some editing mistakes, and we're not probably going to see it at the end of the next path. Unless I decide to go out of my way to re-record the credits just for that. The only difference in the credits is just the music. So yeah, you, so I suppose I could just take You just the, take this clip. I could just take this clip. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll, that's probably what I'll do, and just put the other music on it. Unfortunately, I don't remember what the other track was for the next path we were going down. But anyway. <laughs> yeah, they even, of course, uh, you know, show you cutscenes which you didn't see. These are every single CGI cutscene in the fucking game, which goes to highlight exactly how little budget went into the CGI of this game. Because... Look! This is the same cutscene as the one before, except with slightly different lighting. Fucking lazy cutscene budget.
<sighs> Final thoughts. This pathway... This is the first pathway that anyone's going to play in this game. Any sane person. They're, they're gonna go straight to the end, straight to the end, straight to the end, straight to the end. And they're gonna arrive with this... This is probably one of the worst Shadow things. The Shadow Android ending. It's just like, no matter how you end this particular pathway, you'll get Shadow the Android. And he's not a fucking android, people! He's not! This is... This is probably, I would say, one of, if not... Both of these endings are like one of, if not the worst endings you can get. All of the multiple out of... Uh, there's so many absurd endings to this game. This whole game is freaking absurd. In its design, and its conception. Fucking aliens! Aliens and guns. But you know what? I don't hate it nearly as much as Sonic Heroes. And I really, really hate Sonic Heroes, so that's something to be said. But, uh, anyway. We're nowhere near done. That was just one potential pathway. We'll be back with more next time on Let's Play Shadow the Hedgehog. It's only just begun.